welcome to the Reptile Barn. Uh, I'm here with Caleb. We are taking pictures, and so I figured we'd uh, vlog about it. We are just pulling snake after snake, mostly our babies that are going to go up for sale soon. Uh, Caleb's got a little light box set up. He got some nice bright lights in there. We're getting weights, making sure the gender and genetics are correct, and taking the actual pictures so that next week we can get them up for sale. So I'll take you through the process, and, and Caleb has kind of uh, done most of this, so he will probably do more of the explaining. So let's go. So Caleb, you want to explain what you did here to make this box? Sure. Yeah, it's it's just a little kind of do-it-yourself setup. You just take a cardboard box, uh, cut holes out where the bulbs of the lights go through, one in the top and one in either side, and line the walls with white poster board and try to keep at least on the bottom a uh, one solid clean piece so there's no no breaks or seams or anything for the pictures and that's pretty much it. Yeah, then we'll put it all into our spreadsheet, each snake and all their information, what they're eating, their genetics, their weight and everything like that. Um, this is a little Mojave. They threw the card in there yep. to keep track of which things. Yeah, we've made that mistake before. <laughs> <laughs> we don't put the card in so then we don't know which snake all the next photographs are of. Just set them there. Some of them really behave well and hold still. Other ones need to be uh, coaxed to kind of hold still and find a nice fun pose. And Caleb's got a, I mean, we're just, we're literally taking these with a phone. It's a good phone camera. I don't know what phone you have, but uh, it's a lot better than mine. S9. Yeah, so it's a new phone and the new, the new phones have pretty good cameras. It's certainly good enough for our purposes. Um, we just want the babies to look in the pictures as much like they actually look to your eye as possible. Yeah, see here, this snake is not behaving. <laughs> Gotta kinda calm it down. Nope, he does not want to calm down. He wants to run. Most of them are easier than this. Yeah, this guy's not behaving. Well, of course, that's because we have the vlog camera running. Right. We did like 10 snakes before this <laughs> and all of them behaved. And now this guy wants to run. I got one good picture, but we we'll usually try to get two or three good ones. Yeah. Each. Come on, dude. I'm gonna get bit if I keep messing with him. But okay. it's... you're good. All right, go. Ha ha. There we go. Yeah. So, not much to it. Um. It's worked a lot better since Kale got these really bright lights. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot easier to get good pictures. Oh, and then I take the weight. And our super sophisticated little scale setup over here. Yeah. <laughs> Wait till it zeroes out. 77 grams. And then I go get the next one. All right. And we are going to put diffusers uh, over these lights. Uh, we just kind of threw this together last minute because we had some pictures that we really needed to take. So as soon as we can, we'll get that fixed up too. So yeah, that's we'll be at this for another hour or so. Um, at least. At least, yeah. And then we probably want to take some more pictures of our breeders to put up on our website. Just constant pictures to be taken. It's not really our forte, but we're getting better at it, definitely. The first couple pictures we posted are definitely, I mean, it was like a snake sitting on a towel. The light box <laughs> definitely made a difference. Yeah, that. yeah. I think that's probably the biggest difference. Um, yeah, eventually we'd like to get a couple different backdrops and stuff, but for now, I think they look great on the white. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, please comment below if you have suggestions for improvements we can make. As you can see right now, we have a cardboard box. Um, so let us know if there's simple, cheap ways that we could improve our uh, picture taking. We always are open for suggestions. And until next time, we are the Reptile Bar.